What's up, it's you, Zach from Toy9 here. And today, what guys, I want to guys talk about the Osprey Prime article. This is recently on Google. And that's the What's basically all Transformers and what what life could be really freaky. What's about the evolution of Osprey Prime around the genre? And it's pretty ticklish for sure. But it's great for two that. Now, basically, it's really awesome thing with that. I think it's great for seeing for like for the neighbors because it's Osprey Prime. And they're like for many decades now, for generations since the nineteen eighties, and particularly for sure, it's great for like always being the best thing for last or pretty crazy for sure. Or this been meant for didn't really like that. Now at this time it's been like that from the from the eighties, the nineteen, the two thousand, two thousand tens, and now making movies and all this particularly for sure. Now it's a great for doing a big, what's the next thing for Office Prime? And now it's all that. What's the next movie you guys know? Is it from going to Japan or something like that? Or you guys know that in Japan, they make a great uh, train, Office Prime, as a train, which really, 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 really interesting for sure. It's great for all to me like that. I think it's great per se, like always with all the tech, everything else up your wise, every the CGI, and you know, all the so to um Japan and Sierra like that. Even though the Dodgers Prime or Austin's Primal was pretty good, you know, it's a pretty ticker I'm sure you guys know from last year I reviewed the um the Potential Beast Wars Potential Wars Ride of the Beast you know, it's a movie it was great opportunity like that. Lots of views, lots of everything like that for great doing like that. Anyway guys, I'll see you guys in the second video. Take care, see ya, peace. Scratch. Yeah.